Thanks for watching the world's largest small business summit online. We're so glad you're with us. Well, the common denominator in all small businesses is the bottom line, of course. So whether you're selling real estate or perhaps running a law practice or making gourmet cheese, one eye must always be fixed on your cash flow. Now, of course, not all of us, especially people like me, are experts in financial management. And that's exactly why partner technology specialist Larry Garcia is here. Welcome to the Small Business Summit. Larry, great to have you here. Thank you for having me, Pat. Okay, so you're going to help us because, Absolutely. you know, I'd love to be able to hire you to be there every day to give me advice, but thanks to Office Accounting Professional 2008, right. I, I don't need you there every single day. Don't need to, exactly. Mm -hmm. Complete financial management system specifically designed for small organizations and, and the look and feel of any other office application that you're probably using today already. All right, so give me a couple of reasons why a small business would want to use this system. From quotes to orders to invoices to processing payments, all across the sales cycle, you have a complete integration system that will work with the things you already have as well. It does all those things? Absolutely. You're going to show me how it let's works? Let's take a look. All right, let's get started here. We'll take a look at some demonstrations here. Okay. The first thing that we do is we start up and set up a company. This is one of the mo hardest things in some cases for a small business to actually do, setting up a general ledger, a chart of accounts, all the sub-accounts. So here you can see that we're actually specify a company name and then just determine what type of company am I in, construction, landscape, maybe I'm a retail operation, and it will automatically create all the accounts for me. I can also import my data from existing financial systems, either transactional balances or the entire, or, or master records that is, and pull those directly into office accounting. So it allows me to get started quickly and easily, and I don't spend a lot of time working with an accounting system, I run my business. All right, so it is an easy system, you promised to set Absolutely. up, right? Absolutely. All right, so once we have the system, we're getting started using it, then how is this going to integrate with, with Office that I already have on the computer? I'm so glad you asked because this is probably one of the strongest points of this application. Let's go ahead and take a look here as well. Mm -hmm. What you'll see is in Office Accounting 2008, we can do lots of different things and have it directly tie into Office Word, Office Excel. For example, here is a sales order that I might be able need to be able to get to a customer quickly, easily, uh, and, and be able to process this along the sales cycle. So what I'm going to do is actually send this out to Word. In a, in a a single mouse click, I'm going to get a pre-formatted template uh, that's going to be a very professional, very polished look to it, even including watermarks that I can determine as I need be. So it's already built in. I don't have to create this. It's just a single mouse click to get it out there into Word. And again, I can email this as a Word attachment or as even as a PDF file as well. Also, what we think things can really save a business time is when we think about invoicing our customers. So for example, here, I can have multiple invoices and leverage the standard email merge capabilities of Outlook, of Word, and quickly get this done. Now you'll also notice that once again, these, these emails can go out as PDF attachments or even Word, Word document attachments as well. All right. Well, one, are you done there with giving me the full explanation? I don't want yes. to cut you off too soon. All right. Well, one financial task that certainly can be a real hassle and, you know, time-consuming is payroll. Indeed. You want to keep your employees happy. You want to pay them on time. Mm -hmm. Some want direct deposit. Some want yep. an actual check. So... Yep. How does this work for paying your employees? Real simple and fully integrated once again. Yay. So let's take a look as well. Okay. We'll see that in Office Accounting 2008, when you go to work with your pay your employees, you can actually sign up for an online payroll service for, pro, uh, provided by ADP. It makes affordable, integrated, cost-effective, and secure solution for paying your employees. And it's just Either, automatic. Uh, it well, them. you set it up, and mm -hmm. then you can actually run your payroll in four simple mouse clicks, have signature-ready forms generated for you to pay state, local, and federal taxes, all in a matter of a few, few mouse clicks. And as an online service, you never have to worry about tax table updates or those other things. It's always up to date. That's pretty amazing that you can direct deposit. That seems like something only a big company should exactly. be able to do. Exactly. So it brings that functionality to a small business. All right. So let's talk about how my small business might look to the future. Mm -hmm. This actually has some systems integrated into it that will allow me to sort of look at that, doesn't it, down yeah. the line? When you go to think about managing and growing your business, mm -hmm. it, uh, really integrates well with existing very popular services such as eBay and such as PayPal. So let's also take a look at that. eBay too, huh? 
So we're going to look at some of the online services, and before we do that, we'll take a look at how we can actually determine where, where we stand within our organization. Here is where we can take a look at a profit and loss report, for example, to know where we stand and think about how much our business may need to grow, needs to grow, or otherwise. So in this case, I could actually run this report in a couple of mouse clicks and actually make some modifications to compare it to a previous period of time, such as last year, last month, last quarter, and do this in terms of a percentage or actual dollar amount as well. And you'll notice here, I'm not necessarily a financial analyst, but I can quickly and easily modify this report, and it'll show me in real time the, cap the ability to compare this to previous periods. So you'll notice it runs it dynamically updated, and now I even have the capability to drill into the report to see the actual invoices, where they're being generated from, what customers are actually delivering for me this way, and who I may need to focus my time on. So then it allows me to start to thinking about ways I can expand my operation and, and actually uh, start to grow the business. You'll also see here that I've exported this report directly into Excel, so if I needed to communicate with a partner, a vendor, a banker, or somebody like that, I can very quickly and easily make that happen. You'll see here as I, as I send this out to, again, once again, to a PDF file, makes it really easy to communicate this aspect to, to others, uh, again, partners or, or, or suppliers or vendors. Here, now that I've made some decisions, I'm actually going to set up to sell online through uh, yeah, marketing services. So I can take my products, maybe even a service, and set it up as on a marketplace online and promote my business and sell my products and services through eBay that, this way. It makes it a very effective way, integrates directly into office accounting, makes it real simple to do. If I need to receive a payment, we also integrate with PayPal as well. Again, a popular, well-known service that the, is becoming more and more prevalent in the business industry. So here I can set up to receive PayPal payments. They directly integrate into office accounting 2008 right into my accounting system I don't have to re-enter things over and over again we also integrate of course with Equifax for credit profiles if, if, if you were going to extend me payment terms me as your customer you could actually look up and see how am I doing in terms of my credit profile and whether or not you should extend credit to me for example so it makes it real simple to do that and it brings it right down into your your organization you don't have to be a financial wizard you don't have to be an IT person. Yeah, good. I'm encouraged. I'm ready for my multi-million dollar business now to be run perfectly. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about Outlook. How does it integrate? We only have about 45 seconds left. No problem. We can do that really quickly. Mm -hmm. And I'll actually show you this here. This is also one of the key distinguishing factors of, of office accounting, is that when we look into Outlook, we have the familiar look and feel of our inbox, our calendar, our, uh, our, our tasks. But then we can see here from the business contact manager home, I can work with uh, uh, different aspects of the organ of my business in terms of running those financial reports that we did in Excel and so forth. I can actually look into and create marketing campaigns to promote my business and then send them out via email and then launch that campaign such that it will actually run in Publisher. I can do this flyer this way uh, in Publisher, the tools I'm used to using, <laughs> and then Larry. email merge it out We can as keep well. going, but we've got to cut it no off. Problem. Thank you, Larry. My pleasure. More information on the website. Thank mm -hmm. you.